I have worked on this calculator more than I have used this calculator. <laughs> I picked this up uh, on eBay for three dollars because it was listed as uh, as is as for parts. It was being sold for parts, so let's go ahead and see uh, what we got. I already went ahead and uh, you know removed my address and the sender's uh, the seller's address. This is how you put in the case, okay? The top one goes first. Okay, so there's some liquid here. So this guy didn't even bother to clean this up a little bit. Okay, so this thing might have been liquid damage. And it didn't even bother to hide it. This is sick, man. And uh, you never know. All right, putting the last battery in. Okay, so this thing boots right up. So there was definitely nothing wrong with it. I can't remember exactly what the description was. So, but it was listed as uh, as broken. It was being sold for part. So as you can see, first impression looks great. All the keys are probably going to be working. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it out immediately and uh, inspect the inside. I don't know if there was a missing screw here. I can't really see where the one on the inside because there's a. Uh, it is heavily corroded on the inside there is a lot of corrosion on the inside of this uh, thread right here so i'm gonna assume that there is no uh there is no screw in there okay so i was wrong there's definitely a screw in here like i see the inside was so dirty that uh, my screwdriver had a uh, had trouble trying to uh, uh, pick up the screw you see okay so now that i got that out of the way i can uh, easily open it Okay, that was fairly easy. I am definitely going to wash this. I'm gonna wash this. Uh, you've seen the, you've seen me do this uh, on some of my videos. I'm going to wash it. Uh, I'm gonna stay away from the display. I'm just gonna wash the bottom part. Good thing is there's no corrosion going on here, but there was liquid here. Wow, how did the liquid even get here? Okay, I'm gonna take it to the bathroom and just uh, wash a little bit. I'm gonna take my phone with me so you can see. All right, I put uh, a little bit of uh, soap on this brush right here. And I'm gonna put a little bit of water and uh, just uh, brush it. I really did my best. I think this is as clean as it's gonna get. Okay, so now that I got that out of the way, um, I don't wanna go anywhere near the display because the display is really fragile. So I'm gonna stay away from the display. I could have washed these components as well, but I'd rather not. Uh, this should do it because this is the only one. This is the only part of the calculator that need a cleaning really. So the sun is about to set here, so I'm just gonna put on that. I'm, I'm gonna put outside for maybe 10, 20 minutes and see uh, if it's gonna get dried up. And uh, I'll be right back. Okay, I almost forget about this as well. You know, I always do this in the background, but I wanna show you how I do it. So I just put on soap here and uh, just wash this as well. It would be ideal if you could stay away from this part right here because it's going to take a slightly longer to dry. You know, this is not plastic. This is like some kind of foam that protects the calculator from drop. But uh, yeah, just wash everything with soap and water. Let's see. I was also, uh, I used uh, this swab to go inside of here. You know, just to make sure uh, it's clean. So, I don't really care. I'm just going to put it on to dry. So, yeah, it's going to take longer than expected, but it's okay. All right, I am back uh, after an hour or probably more than that because when I was trying to uh, wash this bottom part section of the keyboard 
you know i just dropped the whole thing and uh, all the keys came off so i just decided to wash the whole thing so i decided to wash the whole casing i replaced this uh, screw with a spare one that i had uh, i had in stock so i won't be using uh, the old one and uh let's check the version of this okay so unfortunately this is the first revision oh never mind why well, don't i have clock that's probably because it is running uh, uh an old firmware yeah i thought so 2 2.5 2.05 so i'm gonna need to update the firmware on this which i'm not in any rush to do so but uh yeah as you can see it is working fine and uh it is hardware revision too that's the one you have you want uh so yeah if you have any questions just make sure you put in the comment section